I would like to get to know if I could be The kind of girl that you could be down for Cause when I look at you I feel something Y'all don't ask me how I ended up in them people mall again Cause I don't know I don't I mean I do know kind of but Don't, don't ask me I don't know, but tell me why I get on Instagram and I see Bath and Body Works has all body care for $4.95. So, who was the first one in there this morning? Me. Now, y'all, we headed to Walmart because Leia asked for a piano. And I was like, that's going to be her one big thing that she gets for Christmas this year. I looked at Target yesterday for the piano, but I didn't find anything. All they had was little baby ones. I'm headed to Walmart now to see if we might get lucky. Leia's actually with my mom now. She was at the mall with me. I did get a couple other things for Christmas gifts up there. So I'll show you guys all that stuff later on. I got me a little gift and stuff. But I think I'm going to do a video of what I got myself for Christmas this year. I don't know. We'll see depending on how much stuff I get myself. I really want to wait to get myself something big until I get everybody's gifts. So I'm just trying to knock out Christmas. Like I'm just trying to knock out Christmas. I had a really early start to today when it came to getting out and going to the stores. It's actually 1.30 now, so it's starting to get a little bit crowded. Now it's a lot of people in the stores, so let's see how this goes. I'm just leaving Qdoba. Um, I went in Walmart, but Walmart didn't have the piano I wanted, and then I went on Amazon. Amazon, it was way cheaper, and it was cuter, and they had it in pink, so I think I'm just gonna order on there. It was either Amazon or Walmart, I seen. It was like $85. The one at Walmart was $139, and they didn't even have it anyways. Just got me and my mom some Qdoba, because that's what sounded good, and she wanted a sugar-free vanilla iced coffee again from McDonald's. But I want to give a shout-out to Cheyenne. Hopefully I just said her name right, girl. I've seen a subby at Qdoba. So, hey, girl. Her name was Cheyenne. She's super cute. She, I was, I've was, i seen her a couple times in there. I was like, why are you just now saying something? She was like, because I'm shy. She cute. <laughs> but, um, yeah, thank you, girl, for watching my channel. It was really, um, it was a lot of people in there today. The past couple times I went up there to that um, Qdoba, it wasn't barely nobody in there. I'm going to check back in with y'all later. I'm about to head back to my mom so we can eat lunch. It is 2.30 now. Oh, I did get Leia something out of Walmart. I'm not going to show y'all everything I got her, though, because I am going to do a video of what I got my daughter or what I got my kid for Christmas. So just stay tuned for that. But one thing about them Qdoba burritos, baby, they be fat. <laughs> hey, y'all. So we've been home for a little minute. <laughs> But I've been cleaning up around the house, y'all. I did two loads of laundry, folded up some laundry, finished the kitchen. I had already did a living room and stuff this morning, but I didn't film that because last weekend, that's what I kind of like filmed and did like my whole weekend reset with y'all. Yeah, but I want to show y'all the stuff that I got today. So I went to Bath and Body Works, as y'all seen at the very beginning of this vlog. I went there because they was having a $4.95 um, body care sale. At the same time, I'm like on the phone with my mama, and so she got a whole bunch of stuff. So all of that stuff that y'all seen, that was not all mine. My mama got a whole bunch of Christmas gifts for other people too, but I am going to show y'all the stuff that I did. And then when I was separating me and my mom's stuff, I went ahead and just did like the gifts and stuff. Like I did the actual gift bag wrapping. This is the first thing I got. They had this new scent called Winter Cherry Blossom. My grandma has always loved the Japanese cherry blossom. And this is my first year seeing this Winter Cherry Blossom. So I smelled it and it smelled so much better than the Japanese cherry blossom. I ended up just getting this for my grandma and y'all know I had got her those three soaps and I'm also gonna give her a candle and I'm also going to buy her and my grandpa a ring camera for their house. I'm pretty much done with them for Christmas. Body care was $5 so I got the ocean um body spray and then i also got a lotion this is from my grandpa this is part of his christmas gift and i feel like the ocean scent is the best scent that they have for men at bath and body works so if you got a man a brother a husband a man an uncle a grandpa a dad get the ocean scent because it smells really really good then i also got another one of those um ocean body sprays because remember okay so i already took this out because i want to put this inside my boyfriend's gift basket or gift bag so um remember i had got the deodorant and the lotion because they didn't have the spray i was so hoping they had the spray today because i wanted to add a spray to his so they had it today and i'm really happy about that 
now this whole little set is done I did get a couple things for me i got me a thousand wishes um body lotion this is the moisturizing body lotion i really love the smell of that and i don't really get their sprays anymore just because i'm so stocked up on them because i really only use them mainly at bedtime because now that i wear like perfume and stuff i wear perfume during the day because it lasts throughout the day and then i'll put on like my bath and body work scents and stuff at nighttime like i have so many like let me show y'all i'm gonna show y'all y'all so these are all my like body mist and stuff so my mom was always obsessed with like bath and body works and victoria's secrets before like i got her into perfume when i started wearing it so i was always obsessed with it too literally a lot of these are completely full like this one is beautiful day i have cucumber melon i have this one that's a little bit gone i have paris amore sweet pea uh oh another beautiful day but that's like an older style um pretty as a peach like a lot of these are literally pretty much full another pair of some more um mango mai tai i use a good amount of that um another pair of some more so i have three of those that's oh pink chiffon oh i forgot about this one i got two Victoria's Secrets one which our favorites were always the love spell and the pink seduction uh, pure seduction so I got those then um one in a million that was my favorite for a long time then oh strawberry pound cake y'all see yeah <laughs> that's gone country apple another love spell one in a million uh hibiscus guava frishka and then what is this sweet pea so like that's all my scents mind you guys the last time i bought like an actual spray from bath and body works was probably either maybe at the beginning of this year or last year like i have not bought any scents from bath and body works like and i know for sure in the last six to nine months literally Pretty much all of these are full, so that's why I don't ever buy the scents. I always just get the lotion. I guess I pretty much just showed y'all my whole little like body mist uh, collection, like all my little body mist. Come get your snack. Thank you. You're welcome. Anyways, I know we had like a quick little intermission. I showed y'all my whole freaking body mist collection. So like I said, I got the uh, Thousand Wishes body wash. I thought this was lotion. Body wash. Oh darn it. I didn't got a whole body wash and I got I picked up the body wash from my mama too. She about to be mad. I seen this exfoliating glow body scrub and I wanted to try it. Y'all know I have been obsessed with scrubs. So I got this one. I did get the In The Stars Ultimate Hydration Body Cream. So I did get at least one lotion for myself. So I got a lotion, a body wash, and a um, exfoli exfoliating body scrub. I really don't like using body washes on my skin though because I can't use it on my feminine area. So I feel like it's just a waste, but it is what it is. It's only $5. Everything that I get myself throughout the month of December, I am not like opening and using until like after Christmas so I can feel like I like got myself some gifts. Speaking of I got myself some gifts, I did grab myself a new pair of earrings. I don't think I'm gonna show y'all in this video though. I think I'm gonna wait until I do my what I got myself for Christmas video, but they're super freaking cute. So I did grab myself some earrings today. So make sure you guys just stay tuned for that video. I did get Leia some shoes and these are for her Christmas gift, one of her Christmas um, gifts. So I just got her some Uggs and I got these. These are super cute. I thought these were perfect because she can wear them throughout the winter, but she can also wear them when the upcoming spring comes. A pair of Uggs and they were only 50 bucks. They say Ugg all along the bottom and these are in a size 11. She can wear these in the snow. She can wear these in the rain. Like, yeah, so I thought these were really cute. I've already bought her three pairs of boots this winter. So I don't know, I might get her some cloth Uggs. I might not, it just depends. I'm just kind of getting out of buying Uggs that are like $130 right now because she's only four and then she only gets to wear them for like 
one or two months she only gets a couple good wears out of them and then it's just like she can't wear them no more until the next year <laughs> and then by the time the next year comes she can't even fit it anymore so i went ahead and got these since they were only 50 bucks and i feel like she can get a lot of wear out of them with those i got these cozy socks that i feel like will be really cute for the winter time to like go you know like how people wear the little cozy socks that you like scrunch up and you can see them through the boot a little bit are over the boot. So I got this pack and this was 15 bucks and it comes with three pairs. It's black, white, and then a light pink. I thought this would be really cute inside of her shoes with different outfits. So yeah, this is going to be something that she's gonna open on Christmas, even though she already seen it because she did have to try the shoes on, but she gonna open it on Christmas too. So I can't remember if I told y'all earlier, but I couldn't find the P-I-A-N-O that I was looking for in Walmart. So I think I'm just gonna order one online. Oh yeah, I did tell y'all that earlier. So I'm about to go ahead and look. I think I seen one that was like $90 that I'm gonna go ahead and get, but I also wanna like redo her room and stuff for the upcoming new year because I think I am gonna go ahead and sign my lease for one more year here so yeah i think it'll look really cute in her room when i redo it so i think i'm going to do the pink one because i think i'm going to get rid of all the mini mouse stuff in her room let's sit down so we can chat a little bit because i do need to talk to y'all about a little bit of stuff i know i was just telling y'all like i hate people who just be talking the whole vlog but i'm not talking the whole vlog like we did some stuff but I do want to sit and talk to y'all about a little bit of stuff because we don't never sit and talk. Like, I really probably just need to do, like, a life update or, like, chit-chat, get ready with me just to talk to y'all. So, let me know if y'all want to see that. And if you want to see a chit-chat, get ready with me or something like that, ask me some questions in the comment section of this video and then we can do that. Let's talk. So, I want to redo Leia's whole room. I'm going to take out, like, all the Minnie Mouse stuff. But like, okay, some of the stuff that she has, like her Minnie Mouse little vanity thing with the sink and all that, I think I'm gonna keep, but the only thing that makes that Minnie Mouse is the sticker, so I'm gonna take that off. So I'm gonna do like a whole video of me like probably redoing her room. I'm gonna get her a new bed. I just want her room to be like a little, not older, but I don't want it to be a character. Like I don't want it to be a specific character because it's like she always wants something different now. Like every like she's asking like, oh, can I have an Elsa room? Can I have a Gabby room? Can I have a Peppa Pig room? So I think I would. I just want to do something like butterflies and pink and like just, just like pinks and whites and creams and stuff like that. So let me know what y'all think about that. I think I'm. I mean, I'm gonna do it if I want to do it anyways. But let me know if y'all think like that's a good idea. Cause I think I'm like gonna sand down her Minnie Mouse table. Cause I want to keep it. Like I, I try to like save as much money as I can and like refurbish stuff so i think i'm gonna sand out her mini mouse table and then like just paint it pink or paint it white um probably pink though because white would probably get dirty really really easily but that's probably something i will start working on after christmas um and see if i can get like her room done within like maybe a few days so i can be ready for the new year or beginning of the new year we'll see we'll see but i'm excited about that but i just want to like talk to y'all like in general i am so excited about the new year like I don't feel like I've ever been this excited about the new year. Like, last year I was excited, but, like, this past year was so crazy. Like, I don't even know what happened. I had, like, some of the best times and some of the worst times this year. I don't know, like, thinking back on what I did, what I accomplished, like, anything this year, I, I don't even know what happened. It's like the whole year just went by. And like, I'm just here. Like, <laughs> I swear when I tell y'all, like, I'm like, dang, what did I really accomplish this year? Like, what did I do different? What did I grow in? Like, I feel like this year was just, I was really just at a plateau. Like, I am just so ready for next year to just really, really be on my stuff. Like, hold myself accountable to the stuff that I wanna do. I wanna get on my stuff, like how, like when I was really, really hungry, like in, I'm I'm still hungry. I always been hungry like but I don't know. I feel like I do be like, dang, like what's next? You know what I'm saying? Like I have a few ideas of things I want to start next year, classes I want to sign up for and things I want to do. I'm not going to mention it on here just because I want to wait until I'm doing it to like take you guys on the journey with me and stuff like that, but I have so much I want to do and I'm just so excited for next year and I just feel like it's going to be a fresh new start and y'all don't understand how much i need that i don't know why i feel like i'm gonna but i'm not 
but I really do need a fresh new start and this year has just been so much y'all and I'm just so excited and I cannot wait for the new year y'all I'm holding back my tears so much because I don't want to cry like y'all know I'd be so freaking sensitive when I say y'all don't know what people are going on going through behind closed doors I really mean that and that's why I don't speak on anything that anybody has going on like celebrities strangers people in my family like I'm not speaking on nothing that you're going through because I don't know what's going on behind closed doors that I don't know about so like just stuff y'all have seen haven't seen like things that have happened off camera that y'all have no clue about y'all might maybe have y'all small assumptions and try to put things together but so much has gone on throughout this year and it's just like I'm just so ready for a fresh new start. I'm so ready to just have like that clean slate where it just feels so clean and fresh. Like I can just start over. And I know I can start over right now. You can start over whenever you want to, but that new year, it just feels so fresh. That's my washer. I know a lot of y'all are probably excited too. And I'm sorry, I just talked y'all ear off for a couple minutes, but I just can't wait. Like I genuinely just can't wait to like, start my life over i just want to i want to really be on my stuff as far as content creating i probably will delete all my instagram pictures i've been like holding on to them just because it's like oh i want to have some type of pictures on my profile but i know i can do better i know i can do better with so much like i have to stop holding on to stuff when it's done it's done some things are not meant to stay in your life forever and that is my issue sometimes I'm just so ready for this fresh new start and I can't wait to take y'all on the journey with me and to hear about y'all journeys and like y'all always feel free to message me on Instagram and tell me like girl I started dental school I started nail school I started cosmetology school really washer always feel free to DM me and talk to me like y'all are my girls y'all are my people y'all are my family like especially I know a lot of y'all have been around for years so always feel free to dm me we can chat it up i might not respond the same exact day on that first initial message because obviously you're going to be in the requested messages but like talk to me about the things that you want to get done and like just on some like girl talk stuff you know so yeah but i know i've been talking sorry y'all but i did just kind of want to talk to y'all get a little bit off my chest because originally when i started youtube that is what i did youtube for is to like have somebody to talk to and show my personality and get things off my chest when i feel like i had nobody so i love y'all but yeah sorry okay y'all so analea is in bed and i'm about to watch this show i've been watching i started this show like two days ago it's called riches i've only been watching like an episode and a half every night because it's only six freaking episodes so i had seen a few people talking about it on tiktok so i was like i'm gonna check it out and it is actually really really good so if you need something new to watch just say it's on netflix it's on amazon prime if you need something new to watch and you got amazon prime definitely check this out this is the show and i am on episode three about halfway not mm, almost halfway through episode three and oh my god <laughs> it is so good so definitely check this out so that is what i'm about to do for the rest of the night is watch this show i know i really didn't do much today this is just one chill day but there will be a lot more fun stuff to come this vlogmas so just make sure you guys stay tuned make sure you guys go back and share and watch some of my vlogmas videos because the views have not been given what they should be but you know i'm very grateful for all my returning subscribers that come back and watch me all the time but um yeah i really really appreciate y'all make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye.